Welcome back. If you're new, you can have me scuttling around inside your skull by subscribing. Click the bell notification and you won't miss anything. Here are 10 stories of people who died trying to retrieve their cell phones. A man had just finished riding the Raptor roller coaster in an amusement park in Ohio when he realised he lost his phone. He figured it must have fell out while he was on the ride, so he decided to jump over a fence, entering a restricted area where the roller coaster was still operating. The man was hit by a train car from the roller coaster and he died at the scene. Back in 2013, a man from Illinois dropped his cell phone in his apartment's trash chute. He then went to recover his phone in the trash room and never returned. After three hours, his wife reported him missing. And when the police investigated the trash room, they discovered his crushed body inside the trash compactor. In San Diego, a teenager was hypnotised by her cell phone while walking down the street. With her eyes still fixated on the phone, she stepped into the path of a semi-truck. She was hit and killed instantly. Her brother, who was walking with her, attempted to pull her out of the way, but it was too late. As he attempted to grab her, she lost her balance and went under the right rear wheels of the trailer. In 2014, a man jumped onto the subway train tracks in Brooklyn and was hit by a passing train. He jumped onto the tracks just after 3am because he dropped his cell phone. The operator of the train at the time spotted him, but couldn't stop the train in time. The man was crushed between the platform and the train and died at the scene. A woman's home was in flames when she and her family safely made it outside. However, after realising her cell phone was still inside, she went back in to rescue it. The woman died from smoke inhalation, despite firefighters trying their best to save her. A man was visiting the San Diego area during Christmas time. He visited the sunset cliffs to view the sunset on Christmas day. Witnesses reported that the 33 year old was walking and staring at his cell phone screen when he suddenly fell 40 feet to his death. He died from serious trauma. In China back in 2014, a woman dropped her brand new cell phone into an open pit toilet. The phone fell into a cesspit. Both her husband and his mother jumped in to retrieve it. However, they were overcome by the powerful fumes. They both fainted and when that happened, the woman who dropped her phone jumped in after them. The woman's husband and his mother died from suffocation. A man from Iowa stopped his truck on a freeway because he spotted a cell phone in the middle of the road and when he attempted to grab it, he was hit by four cars because they couldn't see him in the dark. He died at the scene from his injuries. A 26-year-old man from Minnesota dropped his cell phone into the Chicago River. As he held onto a railing trying to get it back, he lost his balance and fell into the icy waters. Then his friends jumped in after him 
and the situation got worse. The man who dropped his cell phone died in the hospital while his girlfriend disappeared in the cold water where she presumably drowned. His friends were all rushed to the hospital in critical condition. After a man dropped his cell phone onto the tracks of the Christopher Street subway station in New York, he jumped down to get it. While he was trying to pick it up, he was electrocuted by the third rail. He died from his injuries. listening to my voice watch another video right now and remember to subscribe leave me a comment i'd love to know your thoughts and one of you listening right now is gonna have me knock on your window in four three two